Joey, in a previous life, Brandon coach John Lima was a graduate assistant under coach Nick Saban. And even a decade later, you can still see Saban's influence on the Eagles coach. Indeed, like Saban, Lima is driven, meticulous, and not averse to running off an assistant or two who doesn't cut the mustard. Like Saban, he's also a winner. Behind Lima, a seasoned offensive line, and some very promising young skill players, I see Brandon contending for a fourth consecutive playoff berth in 2008. We've got a lot of good young talent that we're excited about. Uh, we're just trying to make them develop as fast as they can so that they can help us early. We've got a difficult schedule early on with Armwood and Middleton right off the bat, so we're just going to do everything we can to get them ready, but uh, talent-wise we feel very good about them. Our offensive line uh, is one of the strengths of our team along with our defensive backs. We have a lot of so solid DBs as well. Um, but offensive line wise, Danny Gonzalez is a returning starter. Chaz Austin's a returning starter. Ben Harrison's a returning starter. Um, and those three guys are all hard working uh, team guys that we feel real good about. But Dylan has uh, you know, really stepped up. His uh, off season commitment's been tremendous. He hasn't missed a day. Uh, really pushed himself in the weight room. Uh, realized that the quarterback spot was wide open and he went after it with, with everything he had. Well, right now, I really like Dylan there. Um, we have Josh Sellerin as well. He comes. He came into the spring game, and uh, the first drive he took us all the way down and scored a touchdown. So uh, right now I know those two are really working really hard. Sean Watson, uh, he's just an all-around athlete. That guy, that guy is uh, amazing. You put him anywhere on the field, and he'll play it, play his heart out at that position. What's it going to take to the playoffs? I think team chemistry. That, that's the main thing we need to focus on. Team chemistry, just playing as a team instead of as an individual. Well, right now, all we're about is practicing like champions, practicing hard, trying to get, trying to get there. That's the one thing we have in common. We're all, that's all we're working for right now. We want to get to that first round of the playoffs and um, just get out there and win and be the first Brandon team in, in, a, in a long time to actually get past the first round of the playoffs. Hello, I'm Izzy Gould. Hello, I'm Bob Putnam. And this is Friday Night Rewind, the second season. Bob, we had a lot of great games in the Bay Area this evening. Yes, we did. Plant and Armwood really stood out. Here's Aaron Murray dropping back for a pass to Alan Sampson for the touchdown. Boo, yeah. Are you freaking kidding me? That is not Friday Night Rewind. There's no fun, there's no frivolity, there's no video highlights, there's no shout outs. That makes my stomach hurt. Boo, yeah. Oh, God, they got to you, too. This is Friday Night Rewind. If you stay ready, you don't have to get ready. If you stay ready, you don't have to get ready. If you stay ready, you don't have to get ready. If you stay ready, if you stay ready. This is Friday Night Rewind.